It was a major goal haul at Daboli Airport on Tuesday morning. The Air Intelligence Unit says 10 kg gold jewellery worth 2 crore rupees. The jewellery was lying abandoned and three plastic bags concealed in a passenger seat. The jewellery was found in Qatar Airways flight from Doha to Goa. The gold is known to be of 18 carats. The bags are in custody of Air Intelligence Unit. However, the bags were not claimed by any passenger. They found these uh, three plastic bags concealed under the seat number 33C. So then uh, they were questioned, uh, nobody was there, no claimant for that uh, gold. Uh, the aircraft crew also were questioned as well as the cleaning staff. Nobody, uh, even the 33C who were occupied the seat and the neighboring seat people were also questioned and all uh, disowned the gold. So after opening these 11 packets, we found that it is containing assorted gold jewellery. Now the value of it has been called to find out the nature of the gold content in that. It is ascertained that it is 18 uh, carat of gold, most of the jewellery, containing some uh, um, stones as well as some other white metal. So the exact value has to be ascertained only after the valuer uh, examines the, uh, the jewellery. So as of now, approximately we can say it will be around uh, 2 crores because it's around 10 kgs total weight. Government buildings will have solar roof tops to make use of reusable energy available. Chief Secretary R.K. Srivastava said he has spoken to Chief Town Planner to amend bylaws of building and housing complexes should be provided with solar water heating system. He was speaking at the second stakeholders consultation workshop. Panji MLA Siddhar Kukarkar informed that Mara Bridge at EDC Pato is in the final designing and tendering process is on. When we are expecting the quality of the services to be smart, we also expect uh, expect that we will go for smart water meters, smart power meters, and then all those things when they are put together, we will also try to harness whatever reusable energy sources are available. I have also taken a decision that all the government buildings initially to begin with, like Secretariat, like Vidhan Sabha, and big buildings, we will try to convert them and provide them with solar rooftop systems. So let there be beginning. I have spoken to Chief Town Planner that we must amend our building bylaws in such a manner that wherever housing complexes are coming, they should be provided with solar water heating system. Perhaps this olden systems we need to revive. It is not that you know old is to be discarded, but we have to pick it up, take better vessels, go with good systems. New entry exit point to the city. And so first thing I did is what strengthening Panji Bhakti ferry boat. We increased it by another one or two ferry boats. During peak hours, they put three or four ferry boats. Otherwise, there used to be only one or two ferry boats. We need to give more exit points, entry points. We are planning a EDC Pato Plaza Mara Bridge, which is almost in a final stage of design and tendering. A two-and-a-half-year-old girl, Mega Bingare of Kharivado Vasco, died on the spot after she came under the wheels of a passenger minibus. The accident took place near Varnapuri Mangur Hill Junction. The disease got down from the bus along with her mother and got crushed under the bus. We got the evening a call here, accident wala mara, Varnapuri. So, accordingly, we are here to spot the visit to the hospital. अच्छा कॉल है कि हमका जी एक चोरवा ची आओ ये जी पढ़ लो यहाँ सब इंजर जब जाओता ले जाओता तो ना बस मोविंग कंडीशन है जाते ली आने के अंदर तो सकल पढ़ ले आने आते तक हॉस्पिटल में आए चिकली विल टेक अ शॉर्ट ब्रेक हेल्थ स्टेट्यूंड